ていただきます。If you guys are wondering, Azusa and I usually do have breakfast in the morning together. Azusa is actually in the bathroom right now. She just woke up.、Um, I woke up a little bit earlier, but she had a hard rehearsal of Don Q yesterday.、Uh, the coffee that we have is called Caribou Coffee. This is a brand of coffee that we had when we did our、uh, guesting in Minnesota for the Nutcracker when I was Cavalier and she was Sugar Plum.、Um, I will link that video either up above or in the comments down below or in the description or something. So in the morning, usually, what I do is I either have like a bowl of oatmeal or eggs or anything light. I don't like to have anything. That'll make me really full and heavy because we always have class the first thing we go into work. I do do a little bit of stretching in the morning before we leave, but we're lucky. Our class today it starts at 11, so you know it's a nice time. All right, breakfast completed. Coffee drank. Now it's off to take a shower and then get ready for the day. I know that a lot of people in Japan, you guys take baths at night, but for me, I'm definitely a shower in the morning kind of guy. Let me know in the comments down below. Do you take a bath at night like all Japanese people, or do you do it a little different like me? Take a shower in the morning. Either way, we're still heat tall. All right, let's take a shower. All right, I'm all showered up. All nice and clean. I put on, of course, tights and a t-shirt, ready for the day. But before we leave, it's still around 9:30, and today's class is not until 11. It takes about five, ten minutes to get there. We're really close. So every morning, I decided to do one extra thing, and that thing is this. As a professional ballet dancer, what I think about most is I really like to set goals that I like to accomplish along the way. This year, I really want to get better feet. My feet are pretty bad for a professional ballet dancer. So what I do is, my mother actually bought me this foot stretcher every single day. I do it in the morning before I leave, and at night at least twice a day, each foot twice, and sometimes three times a day. And I'm seeing a big improvement. It's week three. Haven't missed a day yet. All right. After I stretch, check this out. To the studio. Look at this! I just washed my car a couple days ago. <laughs> It rains one day, and now it's all dirty. But the mountains, oh yeah, they still look beautiful. Hello. <laughs> I'm now in the Utah Metropolitan Ballet's main studio.、Um, I'm the first one here. We have class at 11 o'clock every morning, which is actually a lot later than we usually do.、Um, the protocol they have here is you have to wear a mask when you enter the studio, when you enter the building. They take your temperature. You put hand sanitizer on, sanitize your bar spot, and go in and take class. <music>
So we just finished our day at Utah Metropolitan Ballet. Uh, Azusa had Don Q rehearsal. What we need to do now is we have to actually get a key to our mailbox because we've been living in the same place for about three weeks now. Uh, we haven't been able to get to our mailbox yet. So uh, we have to go to a place called USPS. So hopefully they have the key, they said it'll be ready today and we can finally open up our mailbox. So we just went back to the post office. This was our fifth time going and we finally can open our mailbox. Okay, that's us. Oh, wait. First time in three weeks. Oh my gosh, finally. <laughs> There's not much in there, but we can finally open it. So since we ended so early today, I decided to go to the gym, which is right here at our apartment complexes. Um, I usually go in the mornings, but since we finished so early today, I decided to come now. Since all this craziness is going on, the gym's only open, I think, believe like 10 a.m. to like 6 p.m. So I don't come to this one in the mornings, but I do come here when, um, if I finish early and just get a nice little gym session. So let's do it. We'll make sure. Stay safe. So I'm back from the gym and Azusa told me she wanted me to help her film something. It's going to be a video about her trying to turn for 45 seconds straight. Trying you know? <laughs> <laughs> However, the apartment that we're at, it looks like the Wi-Fi is down. It was down when I was at the gym, so it's probably still down now. I was also going to do some homework. Like you saw in Azusa's video, yes I am in university. I do it online. I'm an accounting major and the only reason I'm doing it is just in case. I get injured, or if anything were to happen where I had to stop dancing, I have something to do. So I guess now what I'm gonna do is stretch my feet for the second time today, because like I said, I have to do at least twice a day. So according to our apartment's manager, uh, apparently the Wi-Fi is down, so we can't really film Azusa's video because we do need the internet for music, editing, and all that stuff. I guess we're gonna have to end this vlog on that note. I want to thank everyone so much for your continued support. I know you guys love these vlogs, and I will keep making more vlogs probably on a weekly basis. Along with the vlogs during the week, there's gonna be some more ballet videos, dancing stuff, Japanese lessons, English lessons, all that cool stuff, and more on this channel during the week. So make sure you hit that subscribe button, like, comment down below. Also, I wanted to let you guys know, we are still doing a 4,000 subscriber giveaway. I have no doubt that all of us together can get us to 4,000. So about 400 people left and we'll reach 4,000 subscribers and we'll be giving one lucky subscriber a special gift from us. So make sure you share this channel and these videos. Thank you so much everyone for watching. Chanju Toroku, Onegaishimasu, and remember, we are Hito.